Hello everyone, and I wonder, there's this game called Raise a Floppa, you might have heard of it. It's a game where you, well, raise a floppa. A floppa is a wild cat called, that's, its wild name is a caracal. And this game uses a cube floppa. And you click on him and he poops out money. So, you can go over to this. And get all sorts of stuff. Don't have a cat bed. So I'm gonna need to get that soon. There's all sorts of stuff, including this monstrosity, which will go and fill the food bowl. Yes. Perfect. Now, I'm going to do some sim. I'm going to do the simplest scripting ever for how to make a game like this. All right. So now we have a little cat bed. Anyway, I'm going to quickly save and leave, and let's get scripting. So if we head over to Roblox Studio, we need, so this we can, we don't need clear output. So first, we need a house. Roblox house. This is what we will use. This is what because this is what Raisa Floppa uses. We need a bunch of room. Now we need to add lights. So the player can actually see. Having it right up there, now we need to rename it light shove it in the house point light range apparently 60 is the max so so yeah I'm going to grab the light of it here, duplicate it, and move it over here. Now this we're going to set to 7, and this we're going to set to 7 as well. So now we have a lit little house. I'm going to add a folder in workspace that will be called base. I'm going to put the house in base. Now this is a group game for my group. So I'm also going to leave it copyable. So next we need a floppa. Floppa cube. Now flop cube. Now we want to wander script. Maybe 
gives you on their script. We can shove that in Floppa Q and Floppa. Okay, instead, I'm going to look at Floppa and PC. We're going to delete this. Rename it Floppa. Let's put it in the center ish of the house. And let's shove it in the base. So now if we go. Right, I forgot we don't have a spawn location. We're gonna set that to the inside of the house. So we need a spawn location. Let's remove the decal, make it have a transparency of one. Shove it here, go and put it in base. So now, we spawn inside the house. Now this guy will wander around. So, wonder check respawn now. Print map is on team. Show tab team. So we can delete this so we just start from now. So it's just a flop of cube that wanders around. We're actually gonna block off this door with a wall because they did that in the actual game. I have a pet bunny that's bothering me right now. So now we've blocked off the front door. This part will be called door. <laughs> now we need to make our little flop of spawn money. So we're gonna money. This is what we're gonna have as dollar. So now we're gonna put it in replicated storage. I'm going to make a folder that will be called currencies. So now, in the floppa, we're going to have in the floppa cube a click detector and we're also going to have a script named the spawn money. Now 
down spawn money local money equals game dot replicate storage dot currencies dot money or what's it called dollar so local click detector equals script up here and dot click detector click detector dot mouse click connect function Money clone new dollar dot parent equals workspace. Now I'm actually going to add a folder. This is going to be money. It's workspace dot money and new dollar dot position equals script up parent dot dot parent dot ears dot position and then wait one second so that they can't just spam 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 with a one nanosecond auto clicker Right, we need to unanchor it. So go into replicated storage currencies. Make sure that this is not locked, locked nor anchored and has can collide on. So now you can spawn dollars. Yay! But when we walk over them to collect them, they don't do anything. We can't add them to our money. Let's fix that. So, first we need an actual money value. So, let's go into server script service, add script, rename setup, and set this to Game dot players dot player added connect function player local money equals instance dot now number value. The reason we're doing a number of values is because then we can have decimals like only one penny or so or stuff like that. Now we need something to do with that money. Money, and so, so we need to set its parent so it's not just existing in the void. So we'll set that to player. Money dot name equals cash. So now we're gonna go to replicate a storage currencies dollar add script. We will call this collect script. So script up ripped up parent dot touched connect function hit. Local player equals game dot players find first child hit dot parent dot name if pl 
player is not equal to nil, then player dot cash dot value plus equals let's say three. We can, you can make it whatever number you want, but we'll, I'm just going to say 3. So now, oh wait, we also need to do script.parent. We want to destroy it, so you can't just collect it multiple times for the same dollar. Now in strategy UI, I'm going to make it so you can actually see how much money you have. We need a screen GUI. Call this a side GUI. Add frame. Actually, you don't need a frame. We can simply add a text button. I mean, a text label. Open transparency 0.7. Background color is completely black. We're going to make this 0 0.65, 0 0.65, actually 0 0.3, yeah that'll do better. Now this text label we're going to move down here, I'm going to set its text to 0 dollars. Now we need a script in it, so actually we're uh, no. player equals script dot parent dot parent dot parent. So that'll go here, here, and here. This will be the player GUI, and then that will be the player. So dot parent dot parent player dot cash dot changed connect connect function function <sighs> If so, we're gonna have script dot parent dot text equals player dot cash dot value dot dot and then dollar sign. <laughs> so now, wait, I'm going to set this to dark green because yes, text color will be light green. Now file save to Roblox just so you don't lose everything. Then let's play. Yes, it works. And we can see our money. Anyway, that'll do for this first episode. We'll do another one soon. See ya, everyone.